Dear friends, the scriptures promise us that even when we do not know how to pray, the Spirit will pray for us with sighs too deep for words. The scriptures also promise us that when we come to confess our wrongdoings before God, to say to God the things that we have done and the things that we have left undone, that God is already waiting there to offer us forgiveness. Trusting in God's gracious mercy, let us pray together our prayer of confession. Holy God, you are with us in every time and place, but sometimes we act as if you reside in a building and we visit you once a week, like a beloved relative in a nursing home. We live as if you are not at work in the world, as if you have little to do with our lives. But we are wrong, O oh God, and we ask for your forgiveness. On that glorious day of Pentecost, when your spirit rushed into the lives of your people, you transformed them. They had been hiding in fear, but now they were on fire with zeal to share the good news. Ignite our hearts that have grown cold. Renew our spirits with your spirit. And show us how to be the church, even when we cannot come into the building. We pray in the name of your Son, Jesus. friends, the Spirit comes to renew us, to remind us, to restore us. We are redeemed as God's people, filled with God's Spirit, called to serve God's world. Rejoice, people of God, and be filled with the Spirit. In Jesus Christ, we are forgiven. Thanks, Thanks be, be to God. To God. Amen. Amen. 